Alright people, welcome back. More vitamin Y. So today is Wednesday and once again it is Zubelic Seas. Zubelic Seas approaching like number 100. Should be soon. No, maybe. It seems like it shouldn't just because if it was reaching number 100, when when that mean that we'd have to be like in episode 700? I think we're like in 80 something I want to say. 80, 83, 84 off the top of my mind. So it seems like we still got, you know, a nice handful of zilks, right? Because you get one of these per week, seven days in a week, times 100. So we'd have to be at, like, episode 700 of... Not sure what was episode 100. I think Super Vicey Bell was episode 1. So I think Super Vicey Bell is going to be episode 700. But, uh, yeah. Just, I don't know. I'm just curious about that because there's a ton of episodes. I don't know. But I can't remember what episodes this is. Seven, five, no, 570... 70, I don't know, six, four, 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 six, seven, four, six, seven, guys. I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I don't, I don't know until I literally upload the video. <laughs> like, like I upload the video, I'm like, oh, this is what episode it is, you know. Or and when I don't make, and I don't do the upload until I make the thumbnail. Uh, I don't, I don't, all the way around, all the way around. When I upload the video, I make the thumbnail. So, talking my random now. I just know it's a UX day. That's it. What number it is? I don't know. What episode it is? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we opened up decently, I must say. Decently, to say the least, because I can actually go and activate one of these called the Haunted Sunny Bell and then go, you know, Galaxy Queen's Light. Oh, okay. Well, that totally reveals what deck we're facing, at least. Now, the question is do I want to do that play? <laughs> that is the question. Because, of course, we can go ahead and just. You know, summon Dark Graph or XC into like, I don't know, like the level chain and go ahead and send and send. So, that is the question right now. What do I want to do? But then I can also summon Dark Graph and summon you Bell, and then if he doesn't stop me, go into Super Chocolate Fudge Covered and wipe all his fucking shit, which would be awesome to say the least. So, but of course, Clock Tower is a pain in the dick because once he gets them counters, I'm gonna be fucked. So, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know right now. Should I continue my plays or should I overextend? Because if I can go and make level all chain, and then level all chain can go ahead and send Aerith. But search me in the fast action affairs, and which is totally fine. But then I will go to have I would have of course level four being Dark Ref again and whoever is Tachi Bell and Aerith in the graveyard. So I can go ahead and activate the message in the bottle. So you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and take it slow. Uh it's better to attack first. Might just be defender. We'll go ahead and attack first. I should be fucking mirror force. Yep, I was like, I was like, it's just, it's probably just gonna be fucking defender, but I'm okay with that. I'm probably gonna keep defender on the field for a little while. I totally don't mind drawing an additional card during the standby phase. The question is, is he, is he gonna do anything with the defender? Because generally that's what you do, you know? You attack, it's a defender, then your opponent's like, ha, ah, defender, 20, 20 something booty. Ooh, spoopy. Like, oh. Okay, so then you're like, oh, well, did I change the deck again? I feel like I changed the deck again, but I just don't know what I changed about it. Something's missing. Did I take out, what's it called? Did I take out Falcon? Falco? Shadal Falcon? Sure looks like it. I don't remember. I, I don't remember. It seemed like it was working okay, but it probably wasn't the best graveyard monster, but I need a different level anyway, because this deck is so reliant on Eris right now. Totally reliant on Eris. Like, if I, if Eris is gone, then I can't even use Message in Bottle, so that's why I put in another Fracko, and I already run the Dragon. The reason why I run Dragon over uh, my Phantom Cast I can usually run is because I can actually summon back... Uh, what's its face? Okay, so he is going to go ahead and get rid of the Defender. I was wondering who was going to go ahead and do that or not. Hmm. Go ahead and use our effect again. I said he didn't want to stop him on his level chain, so I'm assuming that maybe he doesn't have anything to stop me at this current moment. Yeah, I'm not seeing Falco. I must have took it out. It sucks. I might put put you back and pop that one. Since that's the new card, because you didn't stop my level chain, so. Maybe assuming that you're not even gonna, you know, attempt to stop my super chocolate fudge covered either. 
Which wouldn't be terrible. As long as I see, I won't lose fucking 4,000 life points. Alright. Yeah, except. Can't actually summon such something except. For, that's fine. Sure, that's fine. Let's try it. Dragon effect. That one. Uh, okay. Oh, yep. Guess I'll just go ahead and activate message in a bottle. Message in a bottle. One, seven, eight, three. I'm thinking about going ahead and just summoning a monster and then activating it right, just so I can keep you bell on the field. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. Go ahead and summon you. Activate you know, six minutes light. All ten. And you know what? Let's just go into Super Chocolate Fudge Covered, because why not? You got rid of that Defender before I can draw. Super Chocolatey Fudge Covered! You got a response on summon? What? Yeah, what's wrong with what's what's wrong with Xane? He's like XC, no synchro, like yes, it's an XC. What about it? I don't understand, I'm confused about why you're so upset. I did everything legit. Galaxy Queen's light make them all level ten XC with my level ten monsters that I have on the field now, like I don't know why you're so distraught. <laughs> Yes, yes, they were level 10 due to Galaxy Queen's light. Can't type. Target will level seven on how you control. The level of all other phase that monsters currently control become the current level that monsters to the end phase. I target you, Bell, they all become 10. It wasn't that difficult. I'm thinking about playing that other card, or it's like you target a monster with like zero attack or defense, and you make all the monsters in the level. Because it seems like I've been more when it comes to this deck, I I like level manipulation more. Because it really seems like I can't get the XC play started until I do level uh, manip manipulation. Nip 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 manipulation. Can't fucking speak. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and use my effect, and I want to detach you. And wipe your background. Fuck your rock tower. Anybody got time for that? And then he's like, duh. Really? Like, yeah. Uh, you tribute summon for this. Was it like Dasher? No, Mal Mal Mally. He really didn't want me to draw a defender. Uh you can only you can can only do that during, oh my god, during your turn. Head ass man. Well, you know, whatever. Whatever, I don't care. Whatever, I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. Low chain attack. Whatever. I let you do whatever. <laughs> I don't care. I got super chocolate fudge covered, so I don't even give a fuck. Okay. No. If you did not exceed summon after your turn, then you lose 4,000 life points. I exceed summon. I don't take nothing. Shit, if I just had to pay fucking 4,000, I wouldn't fucking do it. 
but yes, I did. Yes, I did. Did super dimensional. It's right there. Right there. That's that. Yeah, right there. Right there. That's six something. <laughs> That's an XC summon. <laughs> Nigga, this is an XC summon. Oh my god. Are you still online? Are you stupid? That was clearly an XC summon. Like, that, that was, uh, uh, <laughs> like head ass nigga. Like, hello? Let's get another duel in. Like, everybody. Like, did, did, uh, am I? Uh, I'm, not, I'm not wrong, right? That was an XC summon? The, I know it looked like an XC mouse to me. Fucking black background. You know, I, the levels were proper. I, I That was three level 10 monsters. So, I don't understand what your problem was. Good. I thought you were gonna get on me for the fact that you built in tribute during interface, but the effect was negated, like Yes. <laughs> uh, can't be worse than my luck. Oh, okay, I guess. So I guess you wanna go ahead and quit and quit and guess. I mean I opened up terrible, so you might be able to go ahead and do your thing. Yes, I can! <laughs> like, holy shit. Mill then draw. Oh my god. Mill then draw. Oh my god. No, it's draw then mill. Never mind. Never mind. I thought it was mill then draw. Never mind. I always thought it was draw. Uh, I always thought it was mill then draw. No, it's, it's draw then mill. Hmm. What? Says that if I don't XC summon, then I take 4,000. Oh my god. Look, right here. Right here. Here's the effect. Right here. Right there. See? Not that fucking difficult. Did you attack? I wasn't even paying attention. I'm fucking dealing with this fucking idiot. I don't even know why I'm talking to him, but, you know. Okay. Still not a good hand. There's not much I can do with this. I'm gonna lose. Yeah, I'm gonna lose. Yep, at this point, definitely gonna lose. I opened up terrible. Terrible. I need. I have triple dark Gruffer, triple Armageddon, a triple Rota, foolish. I, I, you know, I have a whole bunch to send, but I didn't open up well enough. And you got no, you got three. You got three with different names. Like, yep, I'm gonna lose. So you want to tribute somebody? Uh-huh. Alright, he's 19 now. I'm gonna tribute both of them. Oh, you're synchro summoning. You're synchro summoning. Sada striking. Okay. Wouldn't it have been better to attack first? You attack, you could have shaved off half my life points. You literally just fought, lost fifteen hundred life damage for nothing. Nope, still not what I need. So I'm clearly going against Lightsworn, so it doesn't seem like I'll get much use out of this MST, so. Let's see, maybe if I can bait him him using Raikou on it, because I'm assuming this is Raikou. Yep. 
God, I opened up just terrible. Doesn't matter, that's game anyway. I opened up terrible. Yep, that's game. Uh, still, still not good. Actually, actually, you know what? Let me terrible. It's just terrible. Just terrible. Sure, I'll go ahead and take that. All right. You know, sometimes it just sucks when you just draw a fucking ass hat hand. Sounds not much better, but at least it's doable. You know, it's not the most perfect hand. It's a handful of spells now, but maybe maybe I can do something. So go ahead and go Armageddon Knight. Act. Like, I don't even know what that guy was thinking. Go ahead and send Eris. Like I said, if I would have survived, I might have been able to do something. You know, I had, I had Galaxy Wizard in the Grave, so I could use that with the Breeze Dragon. I had Eris in the Grave, so I could use that with Mass Chameleon. Like, I wasn't in a terrible situation, to say the least. But and so I'm not going to get much use of that MST, so let's see if I can bait him into doing anything with it. Hmm. He actually set back row. Alright, charge the light rays. Eh, wasn't the best of metals, but... If you get Illumina, you can go ahead and summon Illumina, pitch a monster, or pitch something, and summon Garrath, and hopefully draw during the end phase, so not a terrible situation. And so I'm not going to get much use out of this MST. I think he plays that uh, Light Sworn Barrier Trap card, though, so. Oh, he's just going to go ahead and grab Lila. That's totally fine. So he's just going to go ahead and summon Lila. Lila effect, go ahead and pop it, but I'm just going to chain it, pop in his card, and then his Lila's going to be in defense. No, he's going to go ahead and sack. Okay, well, then I'm not going to activate the MST. Hmm. Well, I got Aaron, so I guess now is the correct choice would just to go ahead and send you Bell. Go ahead and send you Bell, then I guess at this point I'll go ahead and summon uh, Nefarious Archer Nef Nefariousness and then attack into a Raikou, which at this point really doesn't matter. Uh, maybe I should just go ahead and exceed and get something out of it first, because I'm going to die anyway. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and see. I'm at least gonna get me a mass chameleon out of the out of the deal. Cause I'm gonna die by Reiko anyway, so. so well, at least let me get a mass chameleon and not draw Terror, because clearly Terror's in the top of the fucking deck again. Like, please don't make me draw Terror all the fucking time. Let's go ahead and tap into that Reiko. Flip it up. Emo three. Go ahead and pop me. That's fine. Cause I was gonna die anyway. So. Oh, that's during the damage step. I can't even chain that. Yep, that was totally darn the damage type. Can't train that. So, damn, I thought I could bait his Lila. Oh well. Oh, at least Lila won't get much work anymore. Yeah, one, two, two, three. Yeah, three. Three different names, but you already know two JDs, so. Oh, yeah, five. Oh. God, I. You know what? It didn't matter. He could chain it anyway. One, two, three, four. He sent four. To add one light monster from here. You get four. And I don't even know what happened to that card trooper. You like milled him. How many cards did you have in your hand? You went one, two, three. You get four. For every light. This card your entire hand. Uh, never mind. Never mind. I thought you got it for. I don't even know how many cards you had in your hand. I don't know what happened to Card Trooper. Was he in your hand? I don't even remember. 
So I guess he's just gonna summon JD, wipe, summon JD, summon JD, summon something else. Good old fucking light sworn fashion. Doesn't matter if I have a decent hand or a good hand or anything hand when you just wanna fucking sack the living shit out of me with fucking that, yep. Not really. Like really? GG, like nigga. In, in, all you did was fucking FTK me, essentially. Like, not really. I didn't even get to play. I just got fucking teabagged by fucking JD like usual. It's the only thing that Light Swords can do. See, next turn I could have had some plays. I could have actually had, had fun in this duel. Shit. Uh, that was just, that was my fault though. I didn't think he was gonna have this though. I didn't think I was gonna get gamed. I wanted to take the duel slower. You know, that was my fault because I could have activated. You know, oh no, because I can't. What does it say? You cannot special summon. Except Xe Monster's turn. So I could still, I could've, yeah. I could've made, went May Phase 2, activate Messenger in a bottle, send, summon those three, Gal Galaxy Queen's Light, make them all 10, and then Xe into a Dora. So at least I would've had Dora. And Dora, you know, fucking, JD can't even touch Dora, so. Because as soon as we go JD effect, I'd be like, detach, I'm unaffected. So that was my fault. I should've blocked, but it's I didn't know he was gonna fucking just fucking rip my ass off, so. All right, anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and call it an episode, so. Anyway, I hope you guys at least got a laugh out of fucking that guy being an idiot and me getting fucking completely sacked by Light Swords. But hey, that's all they do. They're just a sacky fucking deck. A skillless, sacky fucking deck. So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys uh, tomorrow with Cosmic Kino. All right, people. Thanks for watching. <laughs>